South Africa is a country with immense challenges. I feel it inside every day. It's, you know, it pains me that to see somebody not eating, to see somebody not having shelter on top of that, I wish I can do more. Brands that have our scale have an immense responsibility to do work that positively impacts the communities in which we operate. Casa Lager is really a, an incredible story. What makes the product so remarkable is that its raw materials are sourced from within the borders of the country. After the process of lautering, we left with all the spent grain. So what we were able to develop is a recipe capturing the spent grain from the brewing process and turning it into a flour. I believe this is a South African first. The South African breweries has always been a, a very innovative company. We now know that the ingredients are of such a high quality that they can be repurposed for a food product like bread. Food has a direct impact on people's productivity. This is why initiatives like this are very important to actually bring more rates into the communities. By partnering with SA Harvest, we're able to make this a, a truly national initiative. So by leveraging their footprint and their existing feeding schemes, we can reach every corner of the country. Bread is a symbol of food. We at SA Harvest are, are really proud to be part of it. In 2022, we delivered just over 20 million meals. The idea that we are working together with breweries, with bread and our program of nutrition makes a completely and totally nutritious meal and at the same time really stave off that feeling of hunger. I do believe this is the first step in something that can hopefully be a lasting legacy for the Castle Lager brand. <laughs> I ate it and I was dancing when I was eating it. I said, oh, this bread is so nice. That is what makes this project so special, is that we can do things that that will impact future generations and really make a difference in society. Bread of the nation. The answer as to why this type of initiative is important, I think is fairly obvious.